Hey guys, it's Mark again. In this video, I have a very awesome driving app that I want to share with you guys. It's called Drive Mode for Android devices. Um, and I'm going to show you guys how it works. It's very awesome, very simple to use, and very nice looking as well. Um, and it's free. Yeah, it's free. So um, here you got, this is your home screen, right? So when you, um, you can set your phone to when, for example, if you turn on the Bluetooth and it connects automatically or it recognizes your your car when it's moving, it will automatically open this app. You could control all that here in settings. If you go to settings, you could control that here. Um, what it's cool that it does is the way that it, it shows you the controls and the way you can manage everything on your phone. Um, for example, here is the home screen. Uh, you can have it like this or in landscape mode if you want. I'm just going to show you guys here in portrait mode. Uh, but this is how it looks. If if Right now it looks white because we, we are on daylight. It's 120. Uh, but if you're driving at night, uh, the screen gets very dark. It looks, it looks like a very dark, uh, dark gray and it looks very cool as well so here uh, you can do nothing right if you tap right here it tells you going somewhere so yes I want to go somewhere if I go, click go to Best Buy I click right there and boom automatically is opening the navigation to go to Best Buy Head southwest on Mesquite Bush Drive awesome. toward Mesquite. so let's go ahead for example I'm just gonna close that and here you have a little tab Settings. And it's going to talk to you. Everything that you do here is going to actually talk to you. Um, let's go and up the volume a little bit. Um, here you got settings. Navigation. Here you got navigation. Music. Music. Contacts. And contacts. That's all you can do here. Music. Navigation. Settings. Um, here in settings, uh, you can see everything that you can do. For example, set default navigation app. Uh, here you can go ahead and choose uh, Google Waze or any, any other map that you want. I use Google Maps. Uh, Save favorite places. If you want to add favorite pl places there, all you got to do is click add, enter whatever address you want there. Or, for example, if you want to add, like, uh, let's say, Coles. Uh, it's, it should look like for a Coles store, right? And there it is. I can just click right there save it and now it's going to add it to my favorites that's it uh you can hear and select music players uh you can select all the music players that you have in your phone uh and it also uh it also selects video players like for example it has a netflix hulu a cbs and all that so it actually recognizes a lot of apps as well and all you got to do is for example is tap on uh, one of them and it's just going to enable it and that's it um, and here you got uh, play music at launch if you want to do that as well uh, be not um, communication settings you got not notify calls and all that ignore uh, this right here is very cool um, preset text that's awesome when you're driving you want to text somebody around fast without typing uh, you can add something here like uh, let's see what else so getting something to eat getting something to eat click save and that's up it's added there you can add more pretext if you want preset text if you want sets uh favorite contacts and all that so basically that's it that's all you can do here in settings click like that if you want to navigate click right there and what i like is that it's you know it's actually telling you what it's seen so GameStop. Cielo Vista Mall. So if I want to go Cielo Vista Mall, tap right there, and boom, Cielo Vista Mall. Head southwest. Awesome. So here you can also navigation music. Go to music, and it should. I think it should launch automatically because we set to or not. If you tap right there, look at that. And this is how easy you can pause and play everything just like that. If you want to swipe to the next track or uh, if you don't have a right now I don't have a next track here so it's just gonna skip forward a little bit but if you had like more tracks all you got to do is swipe right or swipe left to go to the next track that's awesome if you want to switch players go like that Samsung music NFL mobile Netflix see Google Play music pocket casts pocket cast literally looking to get Kevin Durant involved. awesome and that's it about last night to Westbrook, the second best awesome. player on the and just like that that's very awesome you can minimize here and it goes like that music that's awesome i gotta say it 
I, it, it feels so Sounds natural, so easy. so easy to control. Just like that, tap right there and go back, minimize again. Uh, okay, Music. here you go contacts. to contacts, which is awesome as well. Tap right there. And it's going to tell you all the contacts Anthony. that's available there. Aida, mommy. Appointment. Soto. Soto. And it's very Soto. easy. For example, Aida, if you want to call Anthony. somebody, tap right there. Call. call. I'm driving right now. Call you in a... I'll be five minutes late. Okay. I could tap right there send to send it. Message. Boom. And it's go ahead and send the message. Just like that. Just Contacts. that easy. You can send the message. Um, here, if you want to find a contact, GameStop. GameStop FT Bliss. GameStop. Call. That's like that. Tap it there. Boom. And it's going to start calling GameStop. Holy crap. <laughs> Uh, no, minimize. I hope nobody answers. Oh, no, 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 nope, nope. Okay, cancel. <laughs> okay, so that's how easy you do the contacts very easily. So these are the recommended, which basically is going to be like your favorites. Um, and over here, of course, you tap right there Domino's Pizza. No contacts found. Okay, voice search. Really? Domino's? Domino's Pizza there you go. <laughs> Domino's Pizza Dyer. Domino's Pizza and Dyer. Like search. And basically, that's it. That's all you can do here uh, because it's meant to be simple. You know, it's meant to be a simple app. Uh, when you're here out of your phone, like see here, I'm in, in my home screen. I could go ahead and tap right here and it takes Contacts. me back to the drive mode app, which is awesome. And you can also tap right there. It, it will shut it down, the app, if you want. Or you could go ahead here, notifications. Um, let's go and close this and this and this and this. And it's right there. Turn off tab. If you click turn off tab, boom, it's going to turn off the tab. Just like that. But I got to say, it's a very nice app that I think if you're driving and you want to be a little bit more Music. safer while you're driving Contacts. and you just want to be, Music. for Navigation. example, limited to these actions while you're driving, I think this this app does the job very, Music. very, very good. So Contacts. that's it, guys. I just wanted to share this awesome app with you guys. Go ahead and try it out. It's totally free. Um, and it's, I'm surprised that it looks so smooth. It looks so nice. And it doesn't have Navigation. any apps popping up as well. So um, maybe there's a way to donate if you want. Uh, but go ahead and try it out because it's totally free. And for me, it works awesomely. So thanks for watching, guys. This was Drive Mode for Android devices. Till next time, guys.